Hey there, I just wanted to go through this uh, new DE Zero Nano uh, FPGA I got. It's really a neat board. It's got all kinds of uh, general purpose IOs, which I really wanted to see in a board. I don't like when they have all the pre-built in ports, because then you can't really choose what ports you want, because they generally leave you with a couple GPIOs. So I just like this, because it leaves you with like 96 GPIOs or something like that. So... Uh, but right now I'm just I'm going through this TMDS encoder and I'm going to restart the program here. What it does it's this is just a counter but it's displaying the uh, TM, TMDS stage 1 part of the encoding. So let's start it over. There we go. So I don't know, I haven't worked with TMDS before, so I'm just hoping maybe someone can look at this and tell me if this looks like the proper output. Uh Bit 0 is on the right here, and bit 7 is on the left. Uh, the bits 8 and 9 are left out here. They are calculated, but they're just, uh, I don't have enough LEDs, and I didn't want to throw some extra LEDs on here. Um, but once again, this is only stage 1. It doesn't have that inverting stage, because I don't really have any ability to work with the previous byte that was encoded, uh, which you need to do, and uh, I want to implement that later. So I just want to go through and just see if anyone thinks this looks like reasonable output. And if it doesn't, um, then I guess I probably have a bug somewhere in this sea of gates. And that's not good. But uh, this is what I have so far. Hopefully it works. Um, I'm going to probably emulate this uh, writing a little C program. I don't, know if the, I don't know if I have to pay for the little uh, Altera... Uh, simulator program or how well it works but for for first I'm, I'm just gonna implement it and see where I where I write the logic in C so I know I probably won't make mistakes and then I'll compare it to this output uh, all right I'm rambling bye bye